Hello everyone. Now you may have noticed I've not been around for a while. It's because I've, I've been on tour. Um, if you don't know, I actually tour the country. I, I tour the world even uh, with a presentation about mathematics in the same sort of way that I do on YouTube. And it's very popular. So book now to avoid disappointment. But I haven't been able to make videos while on tour. I'm like a shark. I never stop moving. I'm like a very busy shark. Um, if you're interested, you can follow me and find out what I'm up to uh, in the usual places, Twitter, Facebook. I'm not saying it's interesting stuff, it's just me complaining about hotels. But if you are interested, you can find out what I'm up to. Um, but I thought what I'd do is I'd just give you a little update uh, to let you know what I'm up to. Because the videos are coming back, I've been writing scripts, I've been making props, I'm very excited about that. So the videos are coming back. Um, but I, I thought as well that I might leave you with a little puzzle that a, a friend of mine came up with. And we're interested to see uh, what answer. Uh, you get so uh, let's call this the puzzle of the forgetful waiter uh, and it goes like this um, there are seven people having a meal in a restaurant and now on the menu in this restaurant are four items just four items it's steak it's fish it's lamb it's something else so there are four items on this menu so they each order a meal from this set menu now the waiter is writing this down but unfortunately between the table and the kitchen he loses what he wrote down and he's a very forgetful waiter and he has no idea what they ordered so they might have all ordered the steak or none of them have ordered the steak he really doesn't know so in a panic he tells the chef just to make seven meals, just to make seven meals from the menu and then it, just hope for the best, right? So that's what they do. Now, what is the chance that they got it right? Uh, or in other words, uh, what are the possible combinations to do this? Now, we are interested in what you think the answer is, but more, we are interested in how you uh, came to this solution. So if you like, uh, put them in the comments below and until the next time, I'll see you later.